Hello everyone. Today I, Shivani, your science teacher, here to tell you about the topic force and pressure. So, let's move. Today we are going to learn about force and pressure. So the very first question arises in our mind that what is force? Let's see. Pushes and pulls are known as force. The direction in which an object is pushed or pulled is called the direction of the force. We apply force to perform various activities. Force is applied by interaction. Objects must interact with each other for a force to come into play. Example, if you stand in front of a door, it will not open by itself. You have to interact with the door by pushing or pulling and by applying force on it. Net force. When forces are applied on an object from same direction, they add up. The net force of the two forces is a single force which is doubled. Second point, when forces are applied in the different direction, they oppose each other. The net force on the object is the difference between the two forces. Effects of force. First point, force can make a stationary object move or can change its position to rest. Second point, Force can change the speed of moving object. Force can change the direction of motion of a moving object. And force can change the shape or size of an object. Describing a force. A force can be described by stating its magnitude and the direction in which it acts. Like F1 and F2 represent the two forces. F1 is lesser than F2, both acting in the same direction. Types of force. Let's discuss the types of force. There are two types of forces. The first one is contact force and the second one is non-contact force. So, Let's discuss about them. Contact forces. So, frictional forces is a type of a contact force. When you kick a small block of wood, it slides for some time and then comes to rest. This happens because of friction. Friction is a force that slows things or stops down the things. Second one is muscular force. When you lift your school bag or kick a football, you apply a force. This is known as muscular force. The type of force is exerted by muscles. Now, let's discuss about non-contact force. So, we have examples of the non-contact force that is the first one gravitational force. Gravitational force is the force with the earth pulls everything toward itself. This type of force is called non-contact force. Second one is magnetic force. A force which is exerted by a magnet is known as magnetic force or its magnetism. A magnet can act from a distance because it is surrounded by an invisible magnetic field. Hope you have enjoyed the video and learned something from that. So, till then, wait for the next video and stay happy, stay safe. Bye-bye everyone.